you know, sit on the porch and maybe you're the maybe you're the one that smokes and they make you smoke outside. There's all sorts of reasons that you're banished to the outside during the cold weather. But now you've got something that's not only indoor, but outdoor. This is the Westinghouse, of course, a brand name that we all know and love since, you know, forever, since childhood Westinghouse is making amazing products for us. Weatherproof, oscillating infrared heater and infrared is heating you not the air around you, so it's not making everything dry. It's making you warm. We're doing a sell price of $144.99. We're going to do five flex pay because everything's on five flex pay till midnight. We're doing a special uh, for $29. And Luca Puto, who is, I hope brought me some Halloween candy. Yes. <laughs> Here, let me get it. I'll be right back. <laughs> no. Actually, I ate it all. Yeah, you did you all. Because okay. I like me some candy. <laughs> all right. How about that makes this sense. thing? I, you know what? When we were talking about this before the show, I, know. I was like, oh, yes, Space Theater, what a great perfect. Perfect, you know, perfect time of year, and then you're yeah. like, no, no, it can go outside too. It I was can like, go outside. what? What happens if it snows? What happens if there's rain? And you're like, no, it's weather. Doesn't matter. Yeah, and so here's the thing: we've all seen infrared heaters before, so like, you're like, okay, there's really nothing new there. This one, guys, it's weatherproof. You can leave it in the rain. You can leave it in the snow. So you can use this, you know, outdoors, and you could use it indoors if you wanted to. But that's the big deal about this: is that it's one that you can actually submit to the weather. So if okay. it was snowing and you wanted to sit outside, you could actually use this. Now, let me tell you about it, though, because there's a lot of features on this, okay? Right, right. Like you would expect in any infrared heater. For instance, um, this comes with a remote control, so everything I'm about to tell you is going to be on the remote, and the remote actually mounts onto the back of this. So you don't have to be sitting there reaching over to turn it on and off. You can actually use this to do it and do all the settings. Now, this is a 1,200-watt heater, so it's powerful. It has two different heat settings, a 1,200-watt setting, and then if that's too hot, you can back it down to 600 watts. So you've got those two things uh, going for you. As you can see, it swings. So it's going to be moving that heat back and forth. So you're sitting with a group of people. Everybody's going to get a little bit right. of that nice, soothing warmth going back and forth. And then it has a timer. And I love that about this. It starts at a half hour, and then it doubles every time. So it's a half hour, an hour, two hours, and four hours that you can set the timer for. Right. It will shut itself off. Now, as you would expect with any heater, if it tips over, it shuts itself off. If it senses that it's overheating, it will shut itself off. So totally full of safety features. But the big deal is right over there next to you guys. I, you know, Can we walk over here? Because I want to show everybody something I here. I saw this and I was like, do not I do this. have never, do not do this at home. If yeah, you, do if you have a regular this. infrared heater, you don't. Don't do this. But with this Westinghouse heater, I want you to I see. I can't believe this. Look, I mean, there's it's water It's a waterfall pouring. on a, a heater, yeah. a space heater. Yeah, total, but totally safe. And that's the thing. That's why I say, you know, how romantic is it to be sitting outside in a snowstorm, having a couple of cocktails, oh, maybe a nice yeah. glass of wine well, Lou, with you know, a nice heater. So what I want you to think about is, you know yeah. those restaurants that have yes. the outdoor patio? Yes, I do. But then they have those outdoor heaters. Right. That's what you can do in your own patio. No, you totally that can. Is, you know, because I've never seen a product like that, ever. And we have been here 11 years, and you've been here 100, Forever. Since the dawn of man, yes. But here's the since thing, though. Since they created fire. Yes, since they created fire. <laughs> and here we are. And here we are, I bring warming you fire. all of us. But you know what? That's the thing about this is it's the heat without the fire. Because a lot of people, we sit around campfires. Well, guess what? Maybe you've got a sun porch. Maybe you've got an enclosed screen porch or something like that. Did you like to use a couple of seasons? Mm -hmm. Now it becomes a four-season right, porch exactly. for you. Exactly. Yes. Because let's face it, you can't build a fire inside an enclosed area. Right. You can't use propane inside an enclosed area. And that's what a lot of those big heaters outside do. You can't use those. Right. But I'll even do you one better. Okay. Think about this, okay? A fire, if you've got one going, or a propane heater, guess what they do? They heat the air. So let's say it's breezy outside. Where's all the heat going? Not on you. Not on you, wherever it's going. And if it blows right towards you, embers are blowing on exactly. you. Exactly. In case you've turned the TV on and seen California. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Th yeah. This in no way, shape, or form depends on the air to heat things. That's the thing about infrared. Okay, let's talk about that for a second. Infrared heat heats the air and objects in the room, okay? Mm -hmm. Or in this case, on your patio or in your sun porch or wherever you're sitting, okay? So what that means is, it's not so much that the air around you is getting hot, it's warming you, it's warming the furniture, it's warming the carpeting, it's warming everything else around you. And, and over time, those start to radiate the heat as well. Mm -hmm. And that's a much better way to heat because what are we not doing? We're not removing moisture from the air. Right. You know, we're not doing any of those things. Uh, we're not touching nothing to the air at all. This is that nice, soothing heat that people like to say feels like, you know, the warmth of the sun. Right.
You know, that's the big deal about that is it's like the warmth of the sun. That it's a very feels, soothing, uh, penetrating heat. It feels heat. amazing. Like, I do have a question. What Go. is the square footage that this, do you know the answer to that? You know what? It's a, you know, you, we were talking about maybe five, 10 feet away from it. Right. I mean, it's not, it's not going to be like, it's not one of those things that's going to heat the whole room. Right. It's going to heat the area. Right. Okay. Because again, we're heating objects and people. So let me show you something here. Okay. If I take a quick reading off of this and I can put my hand right here, it actually feels amazing because yeah. it's very cold in our it studio. It is so, I was going to say, it's but so cold in our studio. I'm about ready to take off the I take special. a reading uh, off of here. Let me show you something. This says high on it. Now, why does it say? Oh, that says 70, uh, 715 degrees. Yes. Okay, so that's the heat that's coming off the actual element itself. Now, as you get further away, it's gonna dissipate, but that doesn't matter, because right. what it's doing for you is it's heating those objects in the area this, around this it. This doesn't feel hot No, and you know, it's funny, if you feel the back, you top the side, yeah, I was gonna say, it doesn't feel hot. It's just the front of it. Just the front of it. Well, yeah. it has, and see, like, I can that run my warm. hand on this. I mean, I wouldn't leave it in any one place right. for a given period of time, yeah, but if you brush not, up against it, I right. mean, that's fine, you know what I mean? That's there to prevent anybody or anything from touching that infrared element right there. And the thing about infrared heat mm -hmm. is that it is a penetrating heat, okay? Um, you know, if you've ever heard an elderly person, and they always say, like, I just can't get warm. Right, like chilled to the bone. Yeah, chilled to the bone kind right. of thing. Infrared heat penetrates. Infrared heat's the kind of thing that you are going to be able to feel. That's what makes it so wonderful. Now, I'm going to do a demonstration. It's going to take me a second here to set this up, but what I want to show you is we've got one sitting next to the couch back there, okay? okay. And I have an infrared camera with me. And I want you to see something really neat about this because what's cool about the way that this works is when you look at it, you're gonna notice that it's not just heating, you know, like this little space. Right, right, that right. That whole side of the couch is nice and warm. And you're looking at it going like, yeah, but if that side of the couch is warm, what's that gonna do for me? Let me show you, okay, I'm gonna walk back here. Okay. And I'm gonna get you a shot of the couch over here. Oh, look at that. Now. Take a look at that oh, right there. Oh, look at that. And I and, want you to see that. And okay? the reds and the yellows are the warmer areas. That all indicates heat on there. In fact, if I hit the button right here, let's just see. There we go. So you can see that piece of the couch right there is like 100 and something degrees. Now, what that means is it's radiating that heat. So if you're sitting there, I'd back it off you know, if I were sitting in that area, but that's plenty of heat. So everybody on that couch is gonna be able to feel that. Cause the rest of this room, if I went up here to the Christmas tree, I want you to see this. It drops down to like 70 degrees. Oh yeah. And okay? you know, it's cold in here. And this is the Look very first airing. Yes. <laughs> it has not been on air yet. No. And we have had space heaters and small heaters, big heaters and lots of heaters. I have never presented an indoor heater that is weatherproof and is advertised and is like right on the front page outdoors. Use it outside. You use this outside. Right. That is a big deal. We've never done that because yes, I've been to restaurants where they have that pretty outdoor seating and nothing feels better to have like a hot chocolate outside when it's sure. cold, but you're warm and toasty. And that's, a, but imagine doing that at home. This is amazing. What a great gift. What, how, oh, yeah. how thoughtful. And, and today five flex pay and we're, we're launching this with a sale price. So it's not 166.99. That's what's going to be on hsn.com. 144.99, five flex pay of $29. Yeah. I think it's especially good for the, those places that are warmer climates where outside in the winter, yeah. it just gets a little too cold to go outside. Not like, you know, Alaska in February. Well, it, but just, even you know. here in Florida, like in the springtime, exactly. in the, the, spring time in the fall sometimes, it gets cold enough where you're like, you know, do I build a fire? Do I not build a fire? Uh, right, you know, right, right. With this, you don't have to because you can keep that nice area warm out there. The other thing, too, about building a fire is, number one, a lot of work. There's a lot of cleanup with it. Um, and there's all the ash and the smoke and all those other things that go on with this, that's never going to happen. You're never going to have the, you know, any of those other negative elements right. going on. And again, I like it better than a propane heater too, simply because propane tanks are darn heavy, number one. Yeah. Number two, there's actually a fire going on in that thing. There's a flame yes. and you can't use those in a shed. You can't use them in a barn. You can't use them right. in a garage. Yes. Maybe you've got a workshop in a garage. Or indoors. Or indoors. Well, <laughs> in, or indoors at all. At all. This you can. <laughs> this this you is yes. enclosed spaces, right. not a problem for this. But the big deal again, the water, the fact that you can oh, use yeah. this. I mean, take a look at this. If you've got a porch, okay, yeah. and maybe it's a covered porch, um, you can sit out there three, four seasons now mm -hmm. because you're gonna have that perfect heat out there. And I love what they're saying right there. Patios, porches, lanais, gazebos, anything like that, where traditionally, right. even, a, even if you had a really powerful heater that used forced air, 
to push the heat towards you. Remember what I said earlier, if there's a breeze, as soon as that hit, breeze hits that air, where's the air going? It's going someplace else. The heat's not coming to you. This is going to make sure that that heat gets to you. Infrared does not care about the wind at all. That heat is gonna get right to where you need it to go. And remember, once everything starts heating up, once you start heating up, once the furniture mm -hmm. starts heating up the ground, oh, you yeah. know, I have pavers in my backyard. My wife and I were sitting out there the other day. We had one night last week where it was a little chilly. Do you remember this? One night. <laughs> So we decided to take it out there and we had it out there yeah. and the pavers got warm on the ground and they were yeah. radiating heat too. So there's so many benefits to having one of these. I think this is so giftable. I just want oh, to totally. let you know, maybe you're buying this for yourself. We do a 30 day unconditional money back guarantee, but I always find it such an advantage to buy this time of year. Cause even if you're buying it for yourself, you have till January 31st, 2020. And no matter where you live, that's plenty of time to know what it's going to be like outside in the cold. Yeah. Right. Because this time of year, Lou and I were just saying that it's unseasonably warm in Florida on, you know, tomorrow's in November and it's still super hot. But by January, the end of January, we're to know what this is like to have outside. So you can use this till January 31st, 2020. That's where our holiday returns and exchanges uh, cut off. So you've got two, three months, three months to use this to see if you love it. And if you just saw on your screen, it said as one of the places to use it, enclosed areas. Yeah. I like to call that indoors. Indoors. And you know what? And that's, <laughs> right. that's really what it's we're saying. It's right there on the screen. It's really what enclosed we're saying. Enclosed areas. I don't know about you, but my um, house is enclosed. I gotcha. <laughs> yeah. Well, look at the top of this now, and you can see the controls that are up here. You've got your on off. You've got your high low. Remember, 1200 watts is high, 600 watts is low on this. We've got our swing, so I can control that. Do I want it just pointing at me or do I want it to share a little bit of the warmth with other people? You yeah. can totally do that. <laughs> then we've got that timer, half hour, one hour, two hours, four hours, all these settings, but We've also got our handy dandy remote control, which by the way, mounts on the back of this, so you're not going to lose it. But guess what? You can be sitting across the room, across the patio, wherever you are, right. and control it from there. Now, the other thing I wanna show you is let's talk about some of the safety features, because I know when somebody hears heater, they're like, oh, you know. Yeah. This has tip over protection. So this guy right here has been on for a long time. Take a look at this. If I take this and I tip it backwards like this, I don't wanna knock anything off the table. What's gonna happen is once it gets to that point, see how it just went off? Yep. Can you see that? It's so that just turned off because I tipped it. If I stand it up again, I cannot turn it on with the remote. What I'm gonna have to do is hit the on button, just like that, oh. and now it's back on again. Yeah, I mean, they've got so many smart features. If it senses an overload situation, meaning like, it's like, whoa, 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 it's way too hot. Right. It shuts itself off again. Can we show the water? We can show the water, but as you go there, I do wanna let you know, we are very busy on the phone lines. Um, we had a bit of a hold. I know the spin spa, everybody, it went crazy. So if you wanna order this and you don't wanna wait, I would recommend going to hsn.com and putting in the item number, which is right there. It's 669-679, um, and you all also have FlexPay, five FlexPay. So you can do all this online. I do all my shopping at HSN using that free downloadable app to my smartphone. I do all my shopping on my smartphone. You can do it that way. Um, or if you're calling in to talk to a representative, we promise we're gonna get to your calls. I'm just apologizing. We just have a teeny bit of a wait. Right. Yeah. Well, I mean, cause I don't know if anyone's ever seen anything like this before. No, no. And you also know? five FlexPay all the way till midnight. That ends in a couple of hours. So everybody's like trying to get in and on the five FlexPay to, too. Yeah. I've never seen anything like this. It, it's crazy. Why Water on an infrared heater, an indoor outdoor yeah. heater. Never saw a demonstration like this, Lou, ever, ever. And ever. I'll tell you what, when they showed this to me and they put the hose on, I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. You know? <laughs> no, no, right. no, no, no. But look at that. Yeah. It doesn't care. You know, and that's why I love it because I'm lazy at the end of the day. <laughs> I freely admit this. You if work I a can, lot for a lazy guy. Yeah, I do. I do a lot for a lazy <laughs> you do guy. Work a lot but here, for a lazy I'm like, guy. I mean, yeah. And here's the thing. Um, you know, if I can leave it outside, I'm going to. If I can, like, leave it in my shed, if I can leave it right. in my, you know, if I had a barn, if I had a barn, if I could leave it in the barn. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, the basement. I mean, Where do you all put your truck if you don't have a barn? I do, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you <have> <laughs> I, I need, I do like trucks. You do I like trucks. Barn. You know, let's talk about the name Westinghouse. Let's talk about it. They've been around forever. I mean, mm -hmm. you and I, we grew up with them. I, absolutely. You know Westinghouse I mean? appliances in the home, everybody. It's, yes. not, it's not a who's that brand, what's no. that brand. There are it's certain things you just intuitively trust because you've exactly. known them forever. You've had great experiences with them. This is Westinghouse. They know what they're doing. Okay, that's why I tell people, you know what? When you see a brand name like that, you've got to do it. 
Yep, there you go. Oh, it's getting it, warm. I know, it's toasty, but you know, when the water trickles and touches how warm it is, it yeah. does sizzle. It does sizzle. But That's this, gonna happen. It's meant to be outside. Yeah, I but mean, it's fine. this is crazy. Indoor, outdoor. So what I really love about this is that you can have that, you know, outdoor, like, you know, hot cocoa and sit on the porch oh, and yeah. have a little, have a little warm, warm area where you're watching everything. I mean, it, nothing like sitting outside watching the snow come down, but still being warm and cozy, wearing your today's special coat and having this. These two things go together really well. The Westinghouse weatherproof oscillating heater. And that coat. And the coat. I but love it. Weatherproof oscillating heater. Those are three words I've never said on television. No, <laughs> but you can say it now. Now I can. Now you can. Phew. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> I mean, what are you back with this? Uh, I don't have any other shows yeah, scheduled. Okay, so I mean, if we have any left. If we have any left, right. First, right. first show, world launch, and I know there's only a few hundred of them. Yeah. So thank you, my friend. You're welcome. My pleasure. All right. Well, um, here's a little information about pops -a -Lot popcorn, and then we're going to come back with an offer for the holidays from Apple, the iPad. So stay tuned.